So the film happens to be my brother, and this is my second time meeting him, and I've never met somebody more like me ever, and it's crazy to see this. So let me tell you about this film. I love the film, it was really good. Just wanted to finish it to see what actually really happened with the little girl. Uh, I can relate to it with my family, so it really does uh, bring it back home for me. the uncle who escapes to Cuba with the little girl, and my brother happens to be the dad and the father. So he's playing the, he's playing his father's actual role in life and what happened and how my father came here to the US. So in a sense, I sometimes look at it like, I wrote it and I'm like, you know what, that little girl could have been me one day. It could have been me, so it's kind of like, you know, it's coming from a very authentic and a real story. So with that being said, I just, I created it. It was made with love, passion, and the fact that my brother and I was able to use my family in it was even more, more, more valuable to me. So the videography was really, really, really good. I felt like it was touching and I mean, I would love to see the rest. I don't know if I'm supposed to say that, but I only saw a short clip, but I would really, I was intrigued to see the rest. Phenomenal, I mean, we just need to see what's going on because it was really, really good. Really, really good. And anybody support it. Genius. Real good stuff. Oh, um, you guys have to watch this short film and it looks really good. Cuban girl pulling out water from the well. It just looked really enticing. I just want to know what's going to happen. <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen, but it looks really good. Really yeah. As someone who's been very creative, yeah, I've been a and it definitely did a great depiction of like what's going on.